This is a 28 year old lady who came in with neck pain and she also had some other symptoms, jaw pain, ear pain. She had dizziness. She was having episodes of panic attacks for the past couple of weeks and dizziness. And so she was worried and got an MRI of her cervical spine and her cervical spine looked really great. She did not have any compressive disc abnormality. The spinal cord looked normal. And the only thing we noticed was down below the cervical uh, spine on the right hand side, below the right thyroid lobe, there's a little area here that was abnormal right here and this is a classic location for a parathyroid adenoma we did a t2 weighted sequence here you can see it just as well or better right down here and this is a classic signal as well they're usually mildly hyper intense on t2 iso intense on t1 they're behind the thyroid lobe or sometimes below it like this and they can lead to primary hyperparathyroidism and that will lead to elevated serum calcium levels and they get osteoporosis, peptic ulcer disease, fatigue, depression. They uh, get renal calculi more commonly. And I believe this could uh, result in her panic attacks and other symptoms she's having. And so this is, again, what I believe to be a right parathyroid adenoma. This is a coronal T2 weight image here. Nice ovoid margins, hyperintense T2 signal, classic location. And uh, thank you very much.